Hi, I am just in case, and I am expert in everything. My rant for today is about fake people. Discovering that someone you trusted was actually fake can deeply shake you to your core. Instead of blaming them, you may find yourself searching for answers. In order to better understand how you fail to see the truth, it can be helpful to have concrete examples that can aid in detecting their lies. With that being said, here are phrases that fake people often use, supported by psychology. I've got your back this phrase may sound familiar, as fake people are notorious for assuring you that they have your best interests at heart. However, they are quick to betray you when you least expect it. Perhaps you only became aware of their true colors after hearing what they said about you from someone else. They may have even started hurtful rumors about you behind your back. These individuals believe that putting others down and spreading false rumors about them is the only way for them to appear superior. I'm always honest. Fake people often claim to be honest, but their words are tailored to suit specific audiences. Their opinions will change depending on who they are talking to, revealing their two-faced nature. In contrast, trustworthy individuals take the time to reflect on their opinions and are consistent in sharing them, regardless of whether others agree with them or not. You can trust me. Fake people will use this phrase to gain your trust, but only until they no longer need you. Genuine individuals, on the other hand, will consistently demonstrate their trustworthiness through their actions rather than mere words. Once you are no longer useful to them or they are unable to manipulate you, they will abandon you without hesitation. To distinguish between genuine individuals and those who are not, an honest response would be to acknowledge that trust is earned. Sincere individuals never intend to cause harm, and a sincere apology would involve expressing remorse and a commitment to change. However, insincere individuals will only offer excuses, which do nothing. They always find someone else to blame, instead of taking responsibility for their actions. I am simply being honest when I say that they did not intend to hurt your feelings. They are just being real. However, my friend, this is not an excuse. Fake individuals often use this phrase to justify their cruel words, hiding behind the guise of brutal honesty when, in reality, it is a reflection of their lack of compassion. Sarcasm and cynicism are commonly used as defense mechanisms or diversions, allowing them to maintain a sense of superiority. Whether they boost themselves or bring others down, we should distance ourselves. Fake individuals may express agreement to certain things solely for their own satisfaction, only to abandon you in a difficult situation for the hundredth time this year. It is highly probable that they never had any intention of making concrete plans to spend time with you. You may receive a fabricated emergency text at the last minute stating that they cannot make it due to something of great importance. It is impossible not to feel hurt and take their deceitful actions personally. Acknowledging and allowing yourself to feel this hurt requires strength, even though it may be easier to ignore or suppress it. However, it is crucial to understand that their behavior is not a reflection of your worth. They most likely exhibited this behavior before they knew you and will continue to do so long after you have moved on. This is not about you. It is about their internal need to fill a void for which you are not responsible. In all honesty, unless you are a trained professional, it is unlikely that you can help improve their behavior. If you have experienced these phrases being used on you, please share your experiences below. Your support by liking and subscribing for more content. Thank you for watching.